हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू क्रिएटिव मेडिसिन इन दिस लेक्चर वी विल लर्न अबाउट post operatively especially if the patient post operatively the patient might have hypocalcemia after thyroidectomy so the post operative hypocalcemia can be divided into two types it can be either transient hypocalcemia or it can be either prolonged hypocalcemia in transient hypocalcemia the hypocalcemia is present only for uh, a few a some amount of time and after that it disappears if there is transient hypocalcemia then the it depend the treatment depends upon the symptomatic whether the patient is symptomatic or not if the patient is asymptomatic and the calcium level is more than 8 nan mg per deciliter then no treatment is required if the patient has mild symptoms or the calcium level is less than 8 mg per deciliter we can give oral calcium if the calcium if the if the patient has severe symptoms then we should give iv calcium is required sometimes the patient can also have prolonged or permanent hypocalcemia if the patient has prolonged or permanent hypocalcemia in permanent hypocalcemia we wish we should give the patient oral calcium with vitamin d is given thank you and thank you for watching